Hi friends, now we are going to talk about how we can delete uh, change pointers for uh, IDOCs. Okay, you want to delete those because in, that will improve the performance of the system. Okay, so I go to BD22, that's the transaction where we got to go. And once we go here, you can select test run and all those things. And you can select created on or something, process change pointers, obsolete change pointers. And uh, here, if I execute, if you see, there is 191,374 entries in this table that can be obsoleted or something like that. So this is very helpful. Let me check whether we can, if we change this date to 07, change, that will change the, the things here. Yeah. So I think ideally you should be selecting like uh, six months or something, but it's up to you. Different companies have different recommendation. Okay, so here you can do test run. You don't see anything coming. So probably it all started at five, I don't know. So let's see, you have something. So it's up to you. And this is something probably you can schedule it and you can get rid of this. So that will help you in saving some space, both in S4HANA as well as SAP CC6 and will make the system run a little faster. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And